The X-15 was a rocket-powered aircraft that was developed in the 1950s to explore high-speed flight and space travel. The project was a joint effort between the National Advisory Committee for Aeronautics NACA, the U.S. Air Force, and the aerospace company, Bell Aircraft Corporation. The X-15 was designed to reach speeds of up to max 6.7 and altitudes of over 350,000 feet, and was instrumental in advancing our understanding of hypersonic flight and materials science. The origins of the X-15 program can be traced back to the early 1950s, when the US military was exploring new ways to reach higher altitudes and faster speeds. At the same time, NACA was working on developing rocket planes and studying high-speed flight. In 1954, NACA engineer Walter Williams proposed the development of a rocket-powered aircraft that could reach altitudes of over 100 km and speeds of Mach 6 or higher. The following year, the U.S. Air Force joined the project, and Bell Aircraft Corporation was chosen to build the X-15. Robert Woods, a Bell engineer, led the design team and developed the unique shape of the aircraft which was optimized for high-speed flight. The X-15 was powered by a rocket engine and used a combination of liquid oxygen and ammonia as fuel. The X-15 underwent extensive testing and development in the years leading up to its first flight in 1959. Initial tests involved ground testing of the aircraft and rocket engine, as well as captive flights, in which the X-15 was carried aloft by a B-52 bomber and released for free flight. The X-15 made its first powered flight on June 8, 1959, with Air Force pilot Scott Crossfield at the controls. Over the next decade, the X-15 would make 199 flights, with a variety of pilots including Neil Armstrong, Joe Engel, and Pete Knight. The X-15 set numerous records for altitude and speed, including reaching a top speed of Mach 6.7, and an altitude of 354,200 feet. The X-15 program was not without its challenges, however. There were several crashes and fatalities during the testing and development process, highlighting the dangers of high-speed flight. Despite these setbacks, the X-15 program was a major success, paving the way for advancements in high-speed flight, space exploration, and materials science. The X-15 program ended in 1968, with the aircraft being retired and several of the X-15 pilots going on to become astronauts in the NASA space program. The legacy of the X-15 lives on, however, as its groundbreaking achievements continue to inspire new generations of engineers and space enthusiasts.